technically classified no, no, as no. a parasite no, no, no. until oh, it is oh, wow. viable. So, no, I want well, to talk to you about something I, very I, quickly. I can't let you get past that. Are you I'm saying, is saying a baby is a disease or a tumor? A parasite is not a disease and a tumor. Those are not the same thing. A parasite parasite is defined as something that cannot survive outside of its host. A baby, before it is viable, cannot survive outside of a woman's womb. Got it. So let's, extra Therefore, let's extrapolate that. It are, is not a living organism. Are, are, are old people with Alzheimer's and dementia that are being assisted every day, are they parasites? No, they're not parasites. They're human beings who are on the brink of death. Got it. So my six, they are not going to be my four survive. month old that requires mom's breast milk and requires daily changes and feedings cannot survive without its own is my four month old a parasite. Your baby can breathe on its own. Your baby can drink water from its mouth to its stomach. But, but it cannot, Your baby can, can, it, eat can it hunt, food. can it gather, can it reason? But that's not what qualifies something oh, as being okay. a living so let's, organism. Let, let, being let's a living organism terms. simply means, can you survive outside of a womb, but, outside of your host? Got it, so I just wanna make sure I'm clear. Why does that then equate to moral viability? It equates to scientific viability. Why? Under what standard? Because it is not alive. And you oh, are advocating for the rights of something that is not technically a life. Got it. So what is, is something While that sacrificing the needs of the human woman who is alive. Got it. So, but a, a, a mom can survive yes. without the baby in her. Uh-huh. Right? Yes. The baby cannot survive without the mom. Yes. But a mom cannot survive without her lungs. So it's not her body. It's in her body. It's not yeah, her DNA, so it's not her choice. It actually is directly her DNA. It's it is 100%, it's 50% of her DNA.